Paul Label Pogba, born on March 15, 1993, is a French professional footballer who has now joined English club Manchester United. He operates primarily as a central midfielder. Pogba was born in Ligny sur Marne, Saint et Marne, to Guinean parents. Now, he has moved away from Juventus for a record breaking fee and joined Manchester United. Let us look at some life facts of the world's most expensive player, Paul Pogba. Paul is the youngest of the three siblings in the Pogba family. He has two elder brothers Florentin and Matthias, who are twins. Florentin plays in the French Ligue 1 with saint Etienne, while Matthias has played for Wrexham, Crawley Town and now plays for Scottish Premiership side Patrick Thistle. Paul represents France while his twin brothers represent Guinea in international competitions. At the young age of 16, while most players are still trying to find their feet in professional football Paul Pogba hired a personal physiotherapist. According to various reports, he was so obsessed with being in peak physical condition that along with the physiotherapist, he also hired a dietitian to ensure that he was getting the correct nutrition. Paul Pogba had lifted the U20 FIFA World Cup in 2013 and was given the golden ball in the very same tournament. In the same year, Pogba also won the Golden Boy Award, which is presented to the best player under the age of 21. This award was previously won by Wayne Rooney, Lionel Messi, Sergio Aguero, and Mario Gatza. Paul Pogba was instrumental in the group stages for the French team at World 2014 Cuban Pesos. He scored a goal and provided an assist to help his country progress. He was also named as the tournament's best young player. Apart from this, he was also named in the Serie A Team of the Year for 2013-14 and 2014-15, and was part of the UEFA Team of the Year and FIFA FIF Pro World XI in 2015. A young Paul Pogba was signed by Manchester United from L.E. Haver, he was not happy with his development at Old Trafford. He wanted to play in the senior squad as a regular but didn't really get a chance at Manchester United. Pogba only made seven first-team appearances for Manchester United between 2010 and 2012, all of them as substitutes. Eventually, he ran out of patience and left United on a free transfer to join Juventus in 2012. International Career Pogba began his international career for France with the national youth football team. Prior to his international debut, Pogba was named captain of the under-16 team by coach Guy Ferrier. He made his youth international debut on September 23, 2008 in the team's opening match of the campaign against Wales in Lainalee. France won the match 4-2. Under Pogba's leadership, the team recorded impressive victories over Uruguay and Italy in the Tournoi du Valdemarne and defeated the Republic of Ireland by an aggregate score of 8-2 over the course of two matches. On January 31, 2009, he scored his first youth international goal in the 2009 Aegean Cup final against Norway. The goal gave France a 1-0 lead and the team won the match 2-1 to win the tournament. He was a part of the team that played at the 2010 UEFA European Under-17 Championship scoring both of his goals with the team at the tournament. He scored the only goal in the team's 1-0 victory over Portugal in the group stage and netted his second in the team's 2-1 loss to England in the semi-finals. Following the departure of Ferrier as the team's youth international coach, Pogba was reinstated as captain at his age level by new coach Pierre Mankowski. Mankowski had previously been the assistant manager of the senior national team under the reign of Raymond Domenech. Pogba made his under-18 debut on October 27, 2010 at the Tournio de Limoges against Greece in a 4-1 victory. On March 24, 2011, Pogba scored his first goal with the team netting the game-winning goal in a 2-1 win over Germany. The goal was scored from over 30 metres, 33 YD, out. Pogba made his debut with the under-19 team in its first match of the season against Italy on September 6, 2011. In the match, he assisted on two goals, scored by Jean-Christophe Bahabek and Anthony Cura, in a 3-1 victory. On February 29, 2012, 
he scored his first goal for the team in a 2-1 defeat to Spain. In elite round qualification for the 2012 UEFA European Under-19 Championship, Pogba scored the fifth goal in the team's 6-0 route of the Netherlands. The victory qualified France for the competition. On June 11, 2012, Pogba was named to the squad to participate in the tournament. In the team's opening group stage match against Serbia, he converted a penalty in a 3-0 win. France reached the semi-finals where the team faced Spain. In the match, with France trailing 3-2 in extra time, Pogba scored the equalizing goal three minutes prior to the match's completion to send it to penalties. Despite Pogba converting the opening penalty for France, Les Bleuets were defeated 4-2. Due to the under-19 team semi-final appearance in the 2012 UEFA European Under-19 Championship, the nation qualified for the 2013 FIFA U20 World Cup, which merited under-20 team appearances for Pogba. Similar to the previous two seasons, Pogba was installed as captain by Mankowski and made his under-20 debut in a 0-0 draw against China. In the team's next match against North Korea, Pogba scored the team's second goal in a 3-1 win. Pogba was the captain of the team that won France's first ever FIFA U20 World Cup. In that tournament held in Turkey, he played every minute of all of France's matches except for the final group match against Spain, in which he was an unused substitute. He was named the best player of the tournament. Senior On March 22, 2013, Pogba made his debut for the French senior team in a 2014 World Cup qualifier against Georgia. He played the full 90 minutes in a 3-1 win. He scored his first international goal against Belarus on September 10, 2013 in a 4-2 victory, once again during a 2014 World Cup qualifier. On June 6, 2014, Pogba was named in France's squad for the 2014 FIFA World Cup. On June 15, he started in central midfield in the team's first World Cup fixture, a 3-0 victory over Honduras, suffering a foul from Wilson Palacios which led to a red card for the Honduran and a penalty kick, which was converted by Karim Benzema to give France the lead. He appeared as a substitute in the team's second match, assisting a goal for Benzema in a 5-2 victory of Switzerland. In the round of 16, Pogba scored a 79th-minute opening goal and was named man of the match by FIFA as Les Blues defeated Nigeria 2-0 in Brasilia. France were eliminated in the quarterfinals of the competition following a 1-0 defeat to eventual champions Germany on July 4 with Pogba giving away the free kick from which the Germans eventually scored. On July 13, 2014, Pogba was named the tournament's best young player. In May 2016, Pogba was named by national side manager Didier Deschamps to France's 23-man squad for UEFA Euro 2016, to be played on home soil. Although much was expected of Pogba at the upcoming European Championships, in France's opening match of the tournament, a 2-1 win over Romania on June 10, he endured criticism for his perceived negative performance after being played out of position and was subsequently left on the bench by Deschamps for his nation's second group match, later coming on as a second-half substitute in a 2-0 win over Albania. In the round of 16, he was once again the target of media scrutiny for conceding an early penalty against Ireland, prompting former England international Gary Lineker to tweet, Is Pogba the world's most overrated player? France eventually came from behind to win the match 2-1. In the quarter-final match against Iceland on July 3, at the Stade de France, Pogba was able to recapture his form, putting on a dominant performance in his new midfield role, as he scored his nation's second goal of the night from a header following Antoine Griezmann's corner, which he had previously helped to obtain, he later started the play which led to Griezmann's goal, as the host nation advanced to the semi-finals of the competition following a 5-2 win. In the semi-final match against Germany four days later, Pogba was once again started in a deep-lying midfield role alongside Blaise Matuidi in a 4-2-3-1 formation, following Angolo Canti's introduction in the second half, he was shifted to a more advanced role, 
which gave him more tactical freedom, and he subsequently helped to create Griezmann's second goal of the match, as the hosts defeated the reigning World Cup champions 2-0 to advance to the final of the tournament, where they suffered a 1-0 extra time defeat to Portugal. On May 17, 2018, Pogba was named in the France squad for the 2018 FIFA World Cup in Russia. On June 16, 2018, he took the shot that deflected off Aziz Bihik and resulted in the winning goal in France's 2-1 win over Australia in their opening match at the tournament. The goal was initially awarded to Pogba, but the following day FIFA re-awarded it as an own goal to Bihik. In the 59th minute of the 2018 FIFA World Cup final, Pogba extended France's lead over Croatia to 3-1 with a strike from the edge of the penalty area after his initial shot had been blocked. France eventually won the World Cup by a score of 4-2. On June 23, 2021, in France's final group match of UEFA Euro 2020 against Portugal, Pogba assisted Karim Benzema's second goal in a 2-2 draw, which saw them top their group. He later scored with a bending 25-yard strike in the round of 16 match against Switzerland, where France were knocked out of the tournament on penalties after a 3-3 draw. Pogba was ruled out of the 2022 FIFA World Cup in Qatar following knee surgery. Style of play Primarily a central midfielder, although he is also capable of playing on the left flank, in a holding role, as a deep-lying playmaker, in a box-to-box -box role, or even as an attacking midfielder, Pogba was described by Manchester United as a powerful, skillful, and creative player who has an eye for goal and a penchant for the spectacular. He is also capable of playing as an offensive, minded central midfielder, who will often drift out wide, known as the Mezzola role in Italy. During his time in Italy, he gained the nicknames Il Polpo Paul, Paul the Octopus, for his long legs that look like tentacles during tackling or running and Pogbum for his explosive playing style and energy on the pitch. A large, quick, hard-working, and physically strong player, he excels in the air and is also known for his stamina, as well as his powerful and accurate striking ability from distance, he has also drawn praise for his finesse, technique, flair, and dribbling skills, as well as his ability to hold up the ball. His characteristics and playing role in midfield initially led him to be compared with former France international Patrick Vieira in his youth. He is also known for his ability to make forward surging runs from deeper areas of the pitch. During his final season with Juventus, Pogba was deployed in a more advanced and creative midfield role rather than in his usual box to box role, which saw him gain more time on the ball, and he excelled as the team's main playmaker, due to his vision and passing range. His performances in this role saw him develop from a promising youngster into one of the best and most complete midfielders in the world. Upon Pogba's departure from Juventus in 2016, his former teammate Gianluigi Buffon compared him to French former playmakers Michel Platini and Zinedine Zidane, and also praised his ability, leadership, work rate, and attitude, both on the pitch and in training, stating that he, is a tremendous warrior on the pitch but also has so much talent. His control of the ball and the way he can swiftly change the play from defense to attack is special. Pogba is also an effective free kick and penalty taker. Despite his talent, he has been accused of being inconsistent by certain pundits. Moreover, he has also struggled with injuries during his time with Manchester United. Personal Life Pogba is a practicing Muslim. He has been married to Bolivian model Maria Zuloi Salau since 2019, and they have two children together. Pogba is also multilingual, other than his native French, he is also fluent in English, Italian, and Spanish. In August 2017, Pogba spoke about the possibility of openly gay footballers in the Premier League. During a UEFA Respect campaign in Monaco, Pogba said of potential gay footballers that they should be considered equal, stating further that what he does in his private life has nothing to do with the player. You have just to respect him. Because we are all equal when we play football. In March 2022, 
Pogba said that he had suffered from depression whilst being managed by Jose Mourinho at Manchester United during 2018. In August 2022, a French investigation was opened following allegations that Paul Pogba was the victim of an extortion plot involving his brother Matthias Pogba, childhood friends, and witchcraft doctors, also called Marabout. After Matthias published an online video threatening him, Paul revealed to the French police that he had been physically trapped by childhood friends and two gunmen asking him for 13 million euros for past services, including the consultation of witchcraft doctors. He explained that he was also harassed in his training camp in Juventus and that he thought about quitting football. It was revealed that large sums of money were demanded from Pogba to avoid the dissemination of videos allegedly compromising him. Two investigations were opened on suspicion of extortion attempts, one in France, the other in Italy. Pogba has a sponsorship deal with sportswear and equipment supplier Adidas. He appeared in an Adidas 2018 World Cup commercial along with other players in the Adidas stable, including David Beckham, Lionel Messi, and Mohamed Salah, as well as American singer Pharrell Williams. Appearing in EA Sports FIFA video game series, Pogba's goal celebration, the dab, was first featured in FIFA 17. Pogba, with his brothers Florentin and Matthias, attended the 2017 MTV Europe Music Awards in London, where Paul and English actress Natalie Dormer presented the Best Song Award to Canadian singer Sean Mendes. Midfielder for Manchester United FC. England, 2011-12, 2016-2022, and Juventus FC. Italy, 2012-2016, 2022. Younger brother of Florentin Pogba and Matthias Pogba. He was awarded the Italian newspaper Tutto Sport for Golden Boy Award in 2013. Member of the French youth team who won the FIFA U20 World Cup in 2013. Honours with Juventus FC, Serie A, 2012-13, 2013-14, 2014-15, 2015-16, Coppa Italia, 2014-15, 2015-16, Supercoppa Italiana, 2013-2015. Honours with Manchester United FC, EFL Cup, 2016-17, UEFA Europa League, 2016-17. International with France national football team since 2013. Was named in the Serie A team of the year, 2013-14, 2014-15 and 2015-16. Was named in the UEFA team of the year in 2015. Named in the FIFA FIF Pro World 11 in 2015. Named in the ESM team of the year twice, 2015-16 and 2018-19. MVP of the 2016-17 UEFA Europa League. Named in the UEFA Europa League squad of the season twice, 2016-17 and 2020-21. Member of the France national team who won the 2018 FIFA World Cup. His wife is the Bolivian model Maria Zuloi Salaus. Son, with Maria Zuloi Salaus, born in January 2019. Named in the PFA Team of the Year, 2018-19 Premier League. Thank you for watching this video.